guys, this is your girl Alicia Pink and welcome back to my channel. But if you are new here, welcome to my channel. So before I get started, I just want to say thank you guys for clicking in on this video. Also, um, if you are subscribed to this channel, thank you. But if you're not, I want you to I want to welcome you to subscribe to this channel, support your girls, support your small YouTubers, okay? So this is for my Libras, okay? We're going to see what is the energy, what what we need to look out for, for the next 72 hours, okay? This can be uh, timeless, but for the sake of this video, I'm going to be doing it from February uh, 10th to the 12th, okay? And you also have a new moon on February the 11th so we're going to see what's going on but before we get started i want to take three deep breaths three deep breaths i like to start it off with three deep breaths you know just to clear the energy and clear the space so let's get started breathe in breathe it out breathe in breathe it out Breathe in. <sighs> Breathe it out. Okay, let's get started. So we're going to see what's the energy that's going to be surrounding you for this um, new moon that's in Aquarius on February the 11th. What is the energy? Oh, God, there's a lot of cards that came out. What's the energy that's going to be surrounding you? What you need to hear, what you need to know. Okay, I'm calling my angels, my guys, for accurate message, accurate reading for my Libras. Okay, so you got hold on to your vision. Don't let let pride get in in your way. You also have prosperity lies ahead. That's awesome. And also, this just popped out. Expect powerful change expect powerful powerful change that's awesome um that's awesome leavers this is great so your spiritual team is telling you that you know you need to hold on to your vision whatever you're trying to create whatever you're trying to manifest you need to realize that it's on its way to you even if it's no you don't even see it it's not in sight you know, let don't let your pride get in your way so don't let blockages don't let negative self talk people whatever get in your way you know this is what you want you know prosperity lies ahead of you and expect powerful change you know once you change your mindset and change yourself things around you start changing okay let's see what else spirit wants you to know for my libras just pop right out so you got the knight of pentacles you also got the knight of swords a lot of knights so i feel like um libras you're going to be starting a new journey for sure a new journey you're going to be walking away from some things moving on you probably you have to make a, a powerful powerful decision and this decision is you know what you have to do you know it needs to be made and you know it's the only way that you're going to be able to um manifest and be able to create and get the life that you deserve you have the, the queen of cups as well you know this is probably going to be an, an emotional decision for you but you know that it's something that you need to do you also you got another two you know that this is going to create balance. This is going to be a create structure in your life. Okay. You know this. You know this is something that you have to do. Okay. You also got the Ace of Cups. Even though it's going to be emotional. Even though it's going to be difficult. You know. You know that it's for the best. You know that it's going to help you manifest. You got the Magician card. So Spirit's saying have faith. 
okay have faith trust that whatever decision that you're going to make in the next 72 hours is for the best best for you and that um it's going to be a better outcome for you and that um oh god all these cards just came out <laughs> it's going to be a better outcome for you and that um is something that you you have to do if you want to grow, if you want to create, if you want to manifest. If you, you know, sometimes you gotta let go of things, people. You know, sometimes you have to say goodbye to the old you in order for you to grow. You know, rebirth, rebirth, transformation. That's what I'm getting. Rebirth and transformation. You're going to be experiencing that in the next 72 hours you also have the knives of coins so yeah success money the queen of cups once again okay what else spirit has for you i feel like you've been through your tower moment you've been through your tower moment and you are building your way back up to yourself and also you are spending some time alone probably doing some healing you know this you know some you know our spiritual journey is, is always love and light it's not always love and light you know sometimes we we are emotional sometimes we are you know the temperance card you know, it's not always about love and light. You know, sometimes we have to create balance in our life. You know, a lot of the self-healing and the self in the work, we end up having, yeah, the moon card as well. You know, we have, you know, this inner work. <sighs> sometimes we have to go within. Sometimes it's going to be difficult. Sometimes we are going to be afraid to step into the unknown because we don't know what to expect. You know, and I feel like, your fear is probably holding you back. Um, also, with this temperance card, you you know, and this queen of cups and the tower, you know, you you know what it's like to hit rock bottom. You had your tower moment, moment, but you know, tower is not all about bad. Or you know, you are rebuilding yourself back up. You're build, rebuilding yourself back up. Look at the crown, baby. That's you. You are headed for the crown and you're not going to let anybody, not even yourself, hold you back. Not even yourself. You're, you're not going to let yourself hold you back. And that is beautiful. That's beautiful. Okay, let's see what else Spirit has for you with these um, Oracle decks. That I love. The Libras. Okay, one just came right out. You have sun. Paint the sun back into your sky. Yes, I love that. You know, we are all sun. And also, you have villain. Rewrite. You can always rewrite your stories. Do some journaling. You know, we are the main characters of our own story. It's time for you to step up and be the main character of your own story. It's time for you. Like, I didn't I just say you are heading for the crown, your throne, your potential is endless? Yes. Let's go, Libra. Your potential is endless, okay? Nothing is going to hold you back, not even yourself. You can literally be the villain in your your own story. Because the negative self-talk, putting yourself down, is most likely holding you back. It's time that you rewrite the story. It's time that you paint the sun back in your sky. Realize how amazing and powerful you are. Okay, Libra. Let's see what else Spirit has for you. What else we got for my Libra Spirit? I'm just go on the floor. So, nope. 
Okay, so you got hope. The hope is conduit to miracles. Miracles happen each and every day. Remember that. When I'm aligned with the love of the universe, peace cannot be disrupted. Oh, no, no, no. And through prayer and meditation, I create a ripple effect of peace in the world. That is beautiful, okay? Beautiful. And I like to end my readings with a little bit of affirmations. Let's see what's going on, okay? Let's get one card. Okay, you have. Don't take... It personally, if someone starts to speak unkindly to me, I'll remember that they have got something going on that has nothing to do with me. Like maybe they just poop their pants. Yes, and that's probably it. I love that. Let's see what else Spirit has for you. And we're going to end it here. Okay. Okay, you got... I am grateful. I realize that what is right about my life outnumbers what I perceive to be wrong about my life. I choose to focus on what makes me feel good. I am grateful. And that is your reading, Libras. I really hope it resonated with you. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe down below, and hit the notification bell. And follow